So today I want to talk about effort. It is one of the most important topics that we can actually talk about. You know, you've heard me talk about we, sh we move from willful effort to wise effort to effortless effort. It's really important that we understand what I mean by those. Willful effort is our egoic will, right? It's that personal effort that you want something to happen, right? You use it all the time. It's the one that often gets us started meditating. Like it's the same will that gets you to go to the gym. You want something to happen. You want to be happier or you want to be at peace, calmer, perhaps less reactive. There's all these things that, you know, you read about that, uh, you know, how uh, mindfulness and meditation can help you and the personal will gets you started. So I don't discount the importance of that. Without personal will, I would have never gotten going in this, uh, in, in, on this um, journey. Then we could start to realize that oh, I'm, I'm really striving a lot and, and this seems to be get seems to be getting harder. And a teacher might even tell you, yeah, loosen up a bit. In fact, I had a teacher tell me that Lo loosen up a bit. You're, you're just you're kind of you know, hype, hyped up about this. And you're, you know, uh, if you loosen up things, you may, might see that things uh, actually do shift and, and change. And then you start to you know, practice in that kind of more relaxed way. I, I call it wise because it's it's gentler. You could call it gentle effort. You just you kind of just mellow a little, and you kind of go, "Yeah, I got busy mind today. That's fine. That just that's just what happens." You, you start to become a little more uh, open to accepting what's unfolding moment to moment. So not as mu not not as much struggling.